we're heading for the West Midlands and to Villa Park in Birmingham, England's second city in the heart of the country. Today, Aston Villa and Liverpool are set to lay open for examination their respective credentials at the top end of the table. Villa, in truth, have lost their way of late and defeat or even a draw today would surely rule them out of title contention once and for all. Liverpool's progress has been frustratingly inconsistent. The benefit of seven away wins seriously weakened by their habit of drawing too often at Anfield. But a win today would keep up the pressure on Manchester United. For Villa, Ricardo Skimmaker is out through illness, but with Steve Staunton passing a late fitness test, Villa are more or less at full strength. Teenage defender David Hughes, who'd been on standby for Staunton, is among the Villa substitutes. For Liverpool, beaten only once in 11 league games, Robbie Fowler and Stan Collymore are again in tandem up front. They've scored 35 between them this season, and Fowler has chalked up 10 goals in eight games against Villa. The lineup was unchanged from the one held at home by Blackburn. The commentator, John Helm. of goal. Such an acute angle for Fowler. Bosnich did the right thing not to bring him down. Uh, it wouldn't have gone in. Southgate made sure it didn't get anywhere near. Good turn, Milosevic, to get away from Wright. Wright's got back, so Milosevic 
Russia have to take him on a second time. No rolls it in here. The impetus again may have been lost though. Well, Villa do still have possession with Nelson. And with Townsend, it's the left footer. Good try! Well, Andy Townsend has an enviable record of having scored in each of the last 12 seasons in which he's played. And here, having accepted the pass, he puts Swerve on the shot. Just enough to carry it wide of James's goal. I wondered if the keeper had a touch to that. Done. 
Because they're always jostling in the penalty area. improvements on the first in fact we can just about forget the first 45 minutes but Ian Taylor has given us something to savour and to remember from the second half bitter disappointment for Roy Evans as Liverpool lose for the first time since New Year's Day but the memory that will haunt Robbie Fowler is of a simple fluff chance just prior to Taylor's winning goal but it's a significant result in the Premier League and Manchester United retain a four-point advantage at the top. Aston Villa to beat Liverpool by go to Liverpool. 